everyone. I'm Beth Henry Vance with the DEP's Youth Environmental Program. I'm here today to talk to you about rock painting, which is super fun. You can show your creativity. There's tons of ideas out there on the internet. All you need are rocks, acrylic paint, paint brushes, water, and it's optional to have permanent markers, and you can also do a clear coat craft spray. I'm going to show you some of the cool things that you can do, uh, but first you need the rocks. So you need to get um, smooth, pretty hard rocks. You need to wash them with a mild detergent. I used dish soap. I got the dirt off, I rinsed them off, I let them dry. So then they're ready to go. If you do collect rocks from, um, from a river or a stream, please make sure it's a place where you have permission to be there. Please don't get them out of the water itself because you can disturb the habitat for our aquatic species that live in there. And if you don't have a place where you can go collect rocks, you can purchase them at craft stores and you can get any different size. So once you wash them and dry them and they're ready to go, then you can get started. So like I said, you need acrylic paints. They will stay on the rock. You might want to do a couple coats of a solid color first as a base, and then you can decorate them after they dry. So that's what I did with this rock. First, I just painted it black, let it dry. Then after that's done, you can decorate it. So this is one I did with some permanent markers and some paint, and I thought it looked pretty cool. And here are other options. So that one is the same type of thing. I just colored, uh, painted some solid colors, let them dry. And then I went in with permanent marker. And you can do that. You can just do decorations with the markers and paint after the main color is dry. Now this is something that's fun that I enjoyed a lot and my kids enjoyed helping me with and they are little monster rocks. So how I made those is you first do a solid color and let it dry. Then you do eyes. So this one will have three eyes. It'll be a little three-eyed monster. And then after that white paint dries, then you can add the mouth and the uh, finish the black part of the eyeball. And they're kind of cute. You can do all kinds of colors. Obviously, you can just do all colors of paint, just swirl them around, let them dry, do another coat, and that, that's pretty too. And here's one that I did with painting dots, and here's another one I did with painting dots. So that is super fun as well. You can do the tip of a marker, you can do the tip of the paintbrush, you can use a pencil. There are all kinds of things that you can use to make different sized paint dots and let them dry and then you can go back and do another color. So I hope you have fun. Show your creativity to us. What you can do is we have a hashtag YCC Rocks 2020. So you can share a picture of you and your rock with us and we'd love to see it. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.